Hello everyone, I hope you're doing well. So, today I went to the thrift store and I just so happened to pick up one of these. An iPod. Now, for those of you Zoomers out there who do not understand what an iPod is, an iPod is an iPod. I don't know how to describe it. Um, you know what an iPod is, fuck it. I'm assuming you know what an iPod is. I don't care. I'm not your daddy. So, um, <laughs> yeah. I don't know why I wanted to get an iPod. I guess just because. I don't know what I'll do with an iPod. Look at this. You can play, like, the games. Oh, oh fuck. Um, yeah. January 1st, 2000. That's obviously the time of the day. Yeah, we could play some games on it. Fuck. Oh, my God. I, I can't really get... This is... Oh, fuck. Okay. Um, I don't know what I'll do with an iPod, but I'll, maybe I'll put some stuff on here. Maybe some audiobooks, um, music, just stuff that's not on, like, Spotify or anything. Uh, just stuff I listen to that's not on Spotify. And I don't know. I just thought it would be cool. I kind of always wanted one because it looked cool. And, um, yeah. And so when I got this iPod, I realized there is music on it. So I thought... It would be fun <laughs> to look at this whoever this random person whoever had it last um, whoever owned this iPod before oh my god uh, iPod before and intently judge their music taste because I think it's gonna be fun and I can give my thoughts about the music or the musicians or my thoughts on the song and I thought this would be fun. So, yeah, I won't try to make a long intro. I won't try to make this long. Yes. Um, yeah. So, um, hopefully, this is not... This might be a rather intrusive video, but I don't care. I think it's going to be fun. So, let's begin. Starting with the first track out of 366, Air Force Ones by Nelly. I don't think I've listened to this song in particular, but, um, Nelly's alright as a musician, he's kind of, I think most people would say he's not really that good, but I won't lie, there's a, fuck, there's a song I like, um, uh, a couple, uh, what was the song? No matter what I do, Dilemma, I would say the, uh, the girl, the woman in that voice carries that song, uh, and, uh, if you want to go and take a ride with me, that's like, all right. And Nelly's, um, oh, I don't know, the Nickelback of R&B, I guess? I, I, I hate that I, like, keep sleep mode on us. All right, next one. Airplanes by Bob. Now, this song, this song is a classic, I'll tell you what. I mean, once again, um, Bob was a very weird musician back in the day. Um, this song, I don't get it, like, collaborated with, uh, I would say the only songs I remember are this kind of just songs about, with other artists. I did a song with Rivers Cuomo, I got the magic, 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 uh, of Weezer, and this song was with Haley Williams, but I think, oh, I, I do like this song. I know Bob, B-O-B, -B, he's like a flat earther. I remember he made a song about how the earth was flat. Um, and it was really funny, I guess. So, but yeah, this song's a pretty classic, I would say. Airplanes Part 2, I didn't know he made a part 2. I don't think I've listened to that one either. Chris Brown, never listened to a Chris Brown song, no opinion. Justin Bieber, ooh! Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I don't think I've listened to this Christmas cover of All I Want for Christmas. It's an alright song. I, it does get a little overplayed, I guess, but, you know. Oh, yeah, the My Chemical Romance of this cover song, I really like. Um, that's a classic. All We Are. I think I re... I feel like I recognize this song. Um, I feel like if I listened to it, I would know what it is. But One Republic, once again, I think it's like, Oh, the me, love. I don't think I can listen to it right now. I think I need, like, headphones or something. 
yeah, I don't think I'm going to listen to it. But even if it did, it would co get copyrighted, so. Yeah. All of me, I think it's that song. I don't know. Um. Uh, hold on. I have to figure this out. What's going on? Hold on. How do we do this shit? Always Be My Baby by David Cook. I don't think I've heard of this song. Oh, oh, American Idol. That that uh, that also dates this uh this iPod by a lot. Um American Idol. Never really paid attention to American Idol other than like Adam Lambert, I guess. Amsterdam by Guster. Not familiar. Amsterdam by Imagine Dragons. I won't lie. Okay, I won't lie. I do have a soft spot for the first Imagine Dragons album. There's like one or two songs I like. And mainly, maybe it might just be nostalgia, but... Um, if I'll, I'll talk about these songs, but... I don't think I remember this song. But I do have a slight soft spot for the, for the first album. I, I guess it's... It's alright, I'm not gonna act like... Oh... They, they stopped being bad, but I don't know. Occasionally, one at a time, Imagine Dragons is definitely a guilty pleasure, I guess. One Republic, once again, uh, I do like One Republic. They're like a classic. Um, if I can remember, Counting Stars, that's a, that's a classic right there. Apologize, Timberland. I don't know. I, it had, uh... Not, I would think I've heard this song. As long as you love me. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> like I said, Justin Bieber, you know? Um, big Sean, he's alright. I was never really, I was never really a Big Sean fan. A big, big Sean fan. Um, but he, he's alright. It's not like a, I don't know. I don't know what the public opinion on Big Sean is. Ave Marie. Now this. Now this is a classic. Assuming that I know what this is. Um, I don't think I've heard this version, but uh, Ave Maria. Definitely a classic. Obviously. Bang Bang Black Attack. I haven't heard this song. Beatrix and Norman, Nigel Westwake. I haven't heard. Beautiful People, Chris Brown, haven't heard. The Beauty and Ugly. I don't think I've heard the song either. Because of You, Kelly Clarkson. Haven't, I don't think I remember hearing this song, but uh, Kelly Clarkson, I fuck with. I fuck with Kelly Clarkson, I guess. Oh. Uh, oh. Hold on. Because of You, another song. I don't know if that's a cover. I'm guessing that's like a scene girl, once again. Is she very seen to ask? I don't know. I'd have to look. No, not really. She's very old, I guess. I don't, I don't know. She looks like a scene girl looking at this camera lens, but... Uh, scene girls, man. Because of you, Neo. Actually, wait. I... Th I don't... I don't know. I haven't heard this song. But I do... I think he was in that one Pitfall song. <laughs> Tonight, give me everything tonight. I like that song. Uh, slightly. Another guilty pleasure. I just mainly like the uh, the intro. I think Neo sang that. Oh, sorry. Focus. Focus. Beer in Mexico. Kenny Chesney. I haven't heard. Kelly Clarkson. Uh, <laughs> the Polar Express. I kind of hate the Polar Express. I think it tries to. I, I'm sorry. I do not like the Polar Express as a movie. It tries too hard to be a cl Christmas classic, and I've always fucking hated it. Oh my god, and they play... Oh my... Sorry. I, I need to keep myself in check. But I do not like cr Polar Express. It tries too hard to be a Christmas classic. But, but I do like the Nerd Kid. Shout out to the Nerd Kid. He's awesome. Boys to Men. Haven't listened to much of Boys to Men. Bob, once again, Keith Urban, Songs for Japan, a country singer, um, yeah, you could definitely tell, once again, 
dates it really back. Um, the earthquake in Johoku was a uh, very unfortunate, but and I'm um, I'm glad, you know, charity. But Keith Urban, I can't name any Keith Urban songs, but I am familiar. And, you know, growing up in a family that likes country music, um, I don't like modern country music, but you know, Lifehouse. I feel like this is familiar. I feel like I've heard of this artist before. Maybe if I listened to it, I would know. I'm the raindrops. Feet Natasha Benningfield. Not familiar, unfortunately. Black and yellow, black and yellow, black. I'm assuming that's it. The Wiz Khalifa, uh, also a classic. Black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow. Hey. Bleeding out. Imagine Dragons. Blown away. Oh, dude, I'm telling you. I don't know if Carrie Underwood is like a, a country, but dude, they were fucking killing it. They were fucking ki I'll tell you what, man. They were... Sorry, Carrie Underwood, the fucking goats of, um, or I don't know. Wait, I think it's only one person, but Carrie Underwood is definitely a goat. If I were to listen to, I guess, country music, I think. It's very country music-esque anyways, but she's definitely my goat, like, in terms of, like, modern country music. And th this song is definitely one of them. Born This Way. Ooh. Oh, look, it's also on a, a th now that's what I call music. I never got the hate for those albums. Like, are they really that bad? It's just it's just a compilation of like billboard tracks. Like what? I don't I don't get the hate. Um, but yeah, love this song. Uh, shout out to Lady Gaga, gay icon, and you know, as a as a LGBT member, of course, of course, I am a a pay pick to Lady Gaga. Gaga for Gaga, born this way, Glee. Uh, Born This Way Again, Songs for Japan, Both of Us by Bob, The Boy Is Gone, Jason Mraz, I don't think I've heard this song, uh, Break Anotha, Blake Lewis, heard, no, I haven't heard this song, Breakdown, D Dito, okay, I don't think I've listened to a Dito song, wait, yeah, I probably have, yes I have, um, but I know one of their albums, I, I'm not sure, I'm not familiar with Dito, um, as an artist, but at most of the time when I go into a uh, thrift store, I always stumble upon the album Dito No Angel, and it always sticks out to me. Um, you know how much I love thrift stores, anyways. And um, I don't know, it always sticks out to me, and it's like I feel like it's a sign from God that I need to listen to the album. I think they were part of the um, the Eminem, the Stan, uh, that really cool intro. I like that intro. Please don't go. I think that's her business. Speaking of Eminem, Eminem, mm, all right. He's a talented artist, but mm, I was never a big fan. I guess talented rapper. I respect his stuff, but but his new stuff does suck. Um, terrible. But his old stuff, I would say, pretty decent for the time. Um, definitely revolutionary. You can tell why he's so, you know, popular with white people. California Girls, I do like, this song is a pretty good, Katy Perry is a, a pretty good, like, pop artist. I don't know, it's been a while since I listened to this song, but I saw a meme about the, um, uh, the Half-Life thing in the end by Linkin Park. And, uh, hey, it reminded me, like, hey, California Girls is actually a pretty good song. Um, I remember, I remember the music video, it was like, People, kids in elementary school were telling me, like, dude, do not watch this. It's inappropriate. And I did so anyways. Um, where were the people complaining about that when it dropped? Were people complaining about it? I don't know. But, yeah, I remember uh, California Girls. Cal, can I get a... I'm going to assume this is Encore by Jay-Z. Um, yeah, Jay-Z is pretty cool. Uh, definitely one of the greatest rappers, and I'm assuming if this is Encore, it might be another song from their album. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I do like Encore. That's a good song. The Linkin Park cover is also really cool. And, uh, yeah, I fuck with Jay-Z. <sighs> I don't think I've heard this. Kelly Clarkson, pretty cool. I might have heard uh, Catch My Breath, but Chris Brown, all right. Chris Brown again. Oh, I guess it's just like an MP4 thing. Chris Rain. Uh, young Homie. 
Young homie? I don't know. Oh, I guess it's homie. Homie! Dave Matthews. I don't remember. Oh, they made The Devil Went Down in Georgia. Um, yeah, good song. Uh, Whitney Houston, also good. Uh, a lot of Christmas songs here. Cleaning Out My Closet by Eminem. Come Home, haven't listened to it. Come Thou, The Sound of... Hold on. I don't, I don't know what the... The Sound of Glee, I would assume? I don't know. The sound of gl the sound of glep. Either way, I haven't heard. Uh, coming home, Diddy, Dirty Muddy Feet, hearing. I don't know. Uh, can I like turn it sideways? No, I don't think so. Cool like that, Diggable Planet, Country Gary, Nelly. Cowboy, take me, take me away. I think I, I don't think that's the song. Uh, Dixie Chicks. All right. Um, yeah, I remember they were technically canceled because all, all I know about the Dixie Chicks, uh, they did change their name uh, because of uh, uh, the Civil War Confederacy. The Confederacy is not cool. Um, do not rock with the Confederates. That's just me. Thumbs down. This is, hey, Confederates, fuck you. Anyways, and uh, I remember they were um, canceled. They were the first victims of cancel culture because they did not approve of the Iraq war. It's very unfortunate. Um, but I feel like I've heard this song definitely. Crack a Bottle, Eminem, Dr. Dre. Craig David, I'm running all... Away. I don't think I've heard the song. Curtains Up by Eminem. Daylight Maroon 5. Is this songs about... G I don't know. What do I... What? It's Maroon 5. Come on. You know I do not like Maroon 5. The, uh, obviously, first album. Alright. But I don't think this is, um... Yeah, never heard it. I don't think I'm familiar. Demons, it's where my demons hide. Incubus, I did not expect Incubus to be here. I believe they're a metal band, but uh, I don't know. Incubus is very, uh, very much not unlike anything I've seen so far. So that's very interesting. Dirt Road Anthem, I think I've heard this song definitely. Like I said, Country Family, yeah, Jason Aldean, definitely I've heard. Um. There's some there's some charming country songs with how um you know white trash they are but might be one of them. Disturbia, Rihanna. I haven't listened to much Rihanna. Uh, she needs to drop some new shit in my opinion. Do you think about me, Carrie Underwood? Blown away once again. Uh, Goats of country music. Don't let me fall by Bob. Drive Incubus. I think I wanted to listen to that album Drive, but I never got to the chance. Ender's Shadow by Orson Scott Card. Oh wow, this is just the entire, um, I guess they were listening to, uh, this, this audio book. I, I have no opinion on the Ender game, Ender's Game series, because I have not read it. Um, I know that Orson Scott Card is a very, uh, controversial person. So there's a lot of Ender's Shadow. I don't know if I need if that's the sequel. Will I need to like read um, the first one? I don't know. The uh, the Ender's Game, Entourage, by Omarion. I haven't heard. I don't think. Europop. Uh, I don't know what kind of Europop, but I do like Europop. I think I don't know what that is. So this is a song. Every night. I don't know. Why I'm so shaky. And the Dragons. Coldplay, Milo Exadio. Coldplay, once again, another guilty pleasure. I, I like I like Coldplay. I do fuck with Coldplay. They are pretty cool. Um, I don't think I've heard this song. Once again, I don't know. Every teardrop is a waterfall, but it's like, come on, 
You gotta fuck with Cold. You gotta listen to it like a little bit of Coldplay every once in a while. Uh, once again, I don't see the hate because they are. Once again, they're 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 nothing like, not offensively bad. Fun, oh dude, fucking fun, bro. Oh my god, some nights is a fucking classic album, bro. This album is so good, and like all of the single. Oh my god, and uh, yeah, all their solo career stuff. Uh, Night Roos, specifically. Um, really great. Shout out to Fun. Some Nights is definitely one of the... A, a really good album. Uh, at least in my opinion. It's pretty good. Fallen, Imagine Dragons. Falling Slowly, Glenn. I don't know Once soundtrack. I don't know Once Upon a Time? I don't know. The, the, the TV show, Fame by Bob. Oh, Far Away... Hell yeah, I don't think I'm familiar with Nickelback, but I'll tell you what. Nickelback is fucking awesome, bro. You're telling me anybody, anybody who does not like Nickelback is a fucking soulless person. Because they're like, Nickelback is, is like a miserable person. Because Nickelback is so hated, so popular. Like, come on. I don't know how to describe it, but if you do not like Nickelback, I don't trust you. Okay, even if it's ironic, I don't care. You have to like fucking Nickelback in my book. And, uh, yeah. All the Right Reasons. I think that's their first album that came out on 9-11. I think that is, because it's like the car. Um, so imagine buying that album on 9-11. So, uh, yeah. Firework, Songs for Japan. Five on it, Loonies, don't think I've heard. Uh, Fireworks is a pretty good song. I have good memories. I think I sang this song in like a fourth grade choir. Um, yeah. Flyover States, Jason Aldean. Forever, Chris Brown. I don't think I've heard. Forget you. This is a pretty good song, I would say. I like it. Did you know in the original song he says fuck you instead of forget you? This is just a radio version? I do like it. It's pretty great. It's very, uh, of its time. But that, that doesn't, that, I guess that adds to the charm of it, you know? Dr. Dre forgot about D. Dick. Forgot about Dre. I haven't listened to much of Dr. Dre. Geek in the Pink. Never, not familiar with this song. This might be a, yeah, I don't know. Ghost in the Machine, Good Girl, Carrie Underwood. I think I'm probably familiar with that song. Like I said, Carrie Underwood, definitely a goat of country music. Good Life, oh, I hope this is the they have the entire album. But, uh, Graduation, ooh. Graduation. Uh, it's actually, I don't think, gra I, Graduation is definitely not my favorite Kanye album, but, it, yeah, it's definitely, um, you know, Definitely historical, historically significant, and I can definitely see the hype. Um, yeah. And like how, you know, important it was to uh, rap music. Good Pie Apathy, One Republic. Good Life, One Republic. Good Night and Good... Go, good Night and Go. Haven't heard. Gonna Be Tonight, Lifehouse... Hall of Fame, the script. I think this is sitting in the Hall of Fame. Yeah, it's Will I Am. Will I Am, definitely this song. This song's all right. It's definitely um, you know, I don't know how to describe it. Yeah, it's a it's a song that will bring back great memories, I guess, of sports. I think my mom used to listen to this song a lot. Uh, I yeah. Hands all over. I, Maroon 5. It's Maroon 5. Come on. Need I say more? Hard to, hard to, harder to breathe. Songs about Jane. It's songs about Jane, so it's probably good. I'm not going to listen to it. Uh, oh, dude. Rascal Flats, bro. They made the fucking Life is a Highway. That's all I'll recognize them for, but come on. Life is a Highway. Oh, no, dude. That's definitely one of the, the greats. Of, um, yeah, just in general. Just 
one of the greatest songs of all time, definitely. And uh, Cars, I fucking love Cars because I am on the spectrum. Uh, that's an autistic kid, yeah. Hear Me, Imagine Dragons. Hear Me by Kelly Clarkson. Here, Rascal Flats. Hide and Seek, Emogen Heap. Emogen Heap. Don't think I'm familiar, but I guess that might be worth a listen, I guess. Home This Christmas, Justin Bieber. How You Like Me Now, Tony Luca. Might have heard this song. It's very short. It's only like less than two minutes. So, Hunter by Tito. Hurts Like Heaven, Coldplay. I Believe, Fantasia. Don't know this one. I knew you were trouble when you walked in. Um, no opinion. It's pretty good. I, it's, it was definitely overplayed. Definitely overplayed, even today. But Taylor Swift, all right. Um, Taylor Swift, what can I say? <laughs> no opinion. I do like. I have. A, I do have a soft spot for her first country album. I'm not sure how her fans would look at, would think of that. I definitely know a couple Taylor Swift fans, but uh, I do have a soft spot for that first album. I don't know. If, Melt by Rascal Flats. I need a doctor, Dr. Dre. But you are the doctor. With the deuce. I'll Stand By You by Carrie Underwood. I'm Alive by Kenny Chesney. Icebox by Omarion. Haven't heard. If I Am, Nine Days. I might have heard this, but I don't know. It's probably like a Christian song. It, it gives off the Christian vibes. If I Never See Your Face? Yeah, face. That's what I was assuming it would be. What else would it be? If I Never See Your Face Again? I don't think I've heard that song. I don't remember it. If We Hold On Together, Jordan Sparks? No, I don't think I'm familiar. If You Want Me, Want Soundtrack. It's Not Over, Daughtry. It's Okay, See the Green. Songs for Japan. It's time. Okay, okay. This, this song, I, I, I really fucking like this song. If I had to, if I had to listen to one Imagine Dragon song, this would be the one I would listen to. Okay, cause I actually do listen to this song a lot. Like I said, it's a guilty pleasure. If there was like one good Ima Imagine Dragon song that I think is pretty good, it's this one. I fucking love this song. Not gonna lie. It's, it's just really great, and uh. You know, I would say it's the only song that, like, you know, Dan Reynolds, the singer, uh, you can really feel the emotion in his voice. And, uh, yeah, it's a, a song I have a soft spot for. It's a nice melody, too. It's very great. Um, and, uh, you know, Dan, Dan Reynolds, Imagine Dragons, I can't really bring it to me to hate Imagine Dragons, because they just seem too nice of people. I don't know. You know what I mean, Janet Jackson? I don't know... I haven't listened to much Janet Jackson. I haven't listened to much, but she's already cool. Jason Mraz, Shy That Way. Don't think I've listened to it. Javier, 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 Xavier Colin, Stick by Stick. That's French, so I probably have not heard it. Jessica Sanchez, The Prayer. Nessie McCartney, Leaving Jesse McCartney. Jesus, take the wheel. This is a good one. Ben Folds. I think I don't remember. I, I Ben Jesus Land. I don't remember Ben Folds. It's in, that name sounds familiar. Just breathe. Just believe. Never heard. Not familiar. Just breathe. Just dance. It'll be okay. Did they name the game series after this song? Or I don't remember. But I don't know. Like the video game series, I don't know what they named it after this song. Or did they make it? I don't fucking know. Whatever. It's alright. There's two versions. This one has the album cover. Just give me a reason. I Just give me a reason. Just that one? Yeah. Yeah, definitely it's this one. That's alright. That's cool. Just Lose It by Eminem. Just the way you are. 
Um, you, you, if I would say, yeah, Bruno Mars is really um, one of the greats in a you know modern popular music or you know popular music today. Uh, I really fucking love Silk Sonic, the, the the new album, and any any Bruno Mars song that comes on like nowadays, I think I can fuck with. However, I, I'm not really a big fan of, you know, I think this is the common opinion that, you know, I'm not really a big fan of uh, Bruno Mars's really early stuff. Like, the moment I believe Treasure came out, and, um, yeah, that's when, uh, that's when it really got good, because Bruno Mars decided people want to see, like, retro 70s, 80s throwback music from me, and, you know, the rest is history. But, you know, I'm not really a big fan of uh, early stuff. The Kids by Bob, B.O.B. Kiss Kiss by Chris Brown. Last Friday Night. That's a alright song. I Like I said before, Katy Perry's a very decent pop artist. Learn to Fly. Ooh. Yeah, Foo Fighters, man. Yeah, Foo Fighters is fucking awesome. Uh, I haven't listened to this song much, but, you know, Foo Fighters is great. Very uplifting, very nice. Um, I'm not sure if it hears, but Everlong is one of the greatest, you know, rock songs ever created. Um, hot take, but it's it's true. It's it's the facts. Uh, Foo Factors is great, very uplifting, very like feel good music. It's great. Leave me alone. Um, I don't think I've listened to this Michael Jackson. I do like Michael Jackson. Who doesn't like Michael Jackson? Come on, man. Michael Jackson. The Essential Michael Jackson. Uh, yeah, that song. Letting Go by Lupe Fiasco. Lupe Fiasco. Uh, a great rapper. Um, a really, uh, I would, I guess, underappreciated? Um, you know. Uh, yeah. Lupe Fiasco is definitely one of the, uh, one of the great. Definitely, like, I believe Kendrick Lamar. Uh, just basically, like, given the same, like, how we treat Kendrick Lamar nowadays as a, a rap artist. Uh, shout out to Lupe. Life in Color by Coldplay. Might have heard that, but I don't know. Life is Wonderful by Jason Mraz. Living in Fast Forward, Kenny Chesney. Not familiar. Liz on Top of the World, I believe. Pride and Prejudice. Not familiar. The Glee Club. So that's probably another Glee, I would imagine. Another Glee cover? Like I said, oh no, I, I don't know. Like I said, it really dates it. Uh, Locked Out of Heaven? Yeah, that's a another song. I don't know. I don't know how to feel. If that was the song with Treasure on it, then definitely, yeah, I'd like it. This <laughs> is like... <laughs> I don't have to listen to it again. Look at me now by Chris Brown. Look at me now, Chris Brown again. Lost by Coldplay. Love, sex, magic. I don't remember this song. Love story, baby, just say yes. Yeah. Country Taylor Swift. Is that a country album? Is it technically a country album? I guess it's like a good like in between, like the first and the, you know, the red. It, don't ask me on what, why I know this much about Taylor Swift. Love the way you like, you're just gonna st Oh man, I fucking lo like that song. It's alright. It's, it's really funny. I would say. It's it's definitely a product of its time, and it definitely has that vibe of, of a lot of songs that were popular. With, you know, the rap and the uh, the chorus with the, the female vocals. You know what I mean? Love Game, Lady Gaga. Lovelier Than You. Love Me Bad, James Durbin. Lucky by Jason Mraz. Uh, Lumosi, John Williams, Harry Potter. I don't know. I've never watched Harry Potter. Never consumed anything Harry Potter. 
but I guess I, I bet the score is pretty good. Luxurious by Gwen Stefani. I think that I like this. Song. I think and listen, I like I like this song. I think if it's the song I'm thinking about, uh, I like this song. I think it is. Mad Neo. Magic. Yeah, this is the song. This is the song with Rivers Cuomo. I got the magic, magic, magic. What the fuck was Rivers Cuomo and like Weezer doing back then? I swear that was that was literally their fucking midlife crisis. I don't know if they're still going through it. Main title by Corpse Bride. Good movie. Main title. Um. I stance from oh, from Edward Scissorhands. I haven't seen that movie, but I've heard good things about it. It's Halloween, so I should probably watch it. Main title from Home Alone. Make you love me, Robin Thick. Robin Thick, man. Man, god damn that that is definitely like the if it, Bird Lines is definitely like the worst hit song of 2013 ever. I fucking hate that song. Why? And why they play it? Oh my god. No, I f ugh. fuck Robin Thick. Fuck Blurred Lines, bro. I had to listen to that song in the fucking car when I was like 10. And I feel like ugh. that song made me uncomfortable. As like a 10 year old, that song made me uncomfortable. Makes me wonder. Maroon 5. One more night. Maroon 5. Mayberry. Rascal Flats. Me and my gang. Rascal Flats. Might have heard that song. I don't know. Melpy. This is probably like some sex in the widow. The album is literally called Sex Therapy. So it's probably something sexual. That's like an acronym. Maple. Mercy. One Republic. Me Morana by Josh, Josh Goban. Missing You by Puff Daddy. Mockingbird by Eminem. Money by Monko Jackson. Moose Like Jagger. This is a pretty, I'd say this is a pretty good song. But it's kind of stupid. But it is kind of catchy. So I'll give it that. Uh, I definitely prefer the, um, uh. What's it called? Oh, it's the, the studio recover from The Voice. Oh, the, uh, the, the moves, Screw the Nether by, um, um, Yogg's Cast. That's a classic. I'd listen to that song every day. Miss Sexy. Does this guy just sing about sex? Is that just all this whole thing? He's like, I want to fuck my hot, hot sex by C CS5. My life would suck. My life would suck without you. My Love by Justin Timberlake. I haven't heard not really big on Justin Timberlake. I don't think most people are, but I do like Sexy Facts. I think it's a pretty good song. I'm bringing Sexy Facts. Nasty Little Thoughts by Black 3. Never Again by Kelly Clarkson. Maroon Never Gonna Leave. Maroon 5. Never Had It So Good by B.O.B. Bob. Next to You. Chris Brown Fame. Nowhere. Jordan Sparks. No Love. Nobody said, not af I'm not afraid, I'm not afraid, I'm not afraid. That's all right. Nothing on you. Nothing left to say. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Oh, man. This song, this fucking song, Numb Encore. Whew. That, I, I don't know what to say. Linkin Park, Jay Z, come on, man, it's a fucking, ooh, I don't, I have no words to say. Legendary, legendary, that's what I have to say. Uh, nothing but a G thing, Dr. Dre. Oh, come all ye faithful. That's definitely one of my favorite Christmas songs. I think I'll definitely make it like a Christmas song tier list. Um, when the holiday season comes, so expect that maybe. Uh, don't ma don't make any promises. No, not to make any promises. One of my favorite uh, Christmas songs: Oceano, Josh Goban, 
Oh Holy Night by Kelly Clarkson. On Top of the World. Hey, I'm on top of the world. Hey, my dad would always like make a joke about this song where he was like, I'm on top of the world. A, I'm on top of the world. B, I'm on top of the world. C, and I think that's funny. Uh, definitely great. Uh, that's all right. One in a Million, Neo. One Minute by Kelly Clarkson. One Try by the Black Eyed Peas. Well, Black Eyed Peas. Need I say more? Only Girl in the World is gonna... Yeah, Rihanna. I like the song. Pretty good. Over It by Catherine MCP. Over You. I think there's one song on the Japan album that um, I'm assuming if it shows up, I definitely have strong opinions on. I believe it's on there. Paradise by Coldplay. Para, para, paradise. Classic, like I said. Coldplay, classic. Pass Out, Noah, Elf, Author. So I don't know. Pass My Shades, Bob. Payphone. Like I, uh, like I said, I definitely remember hearing a Minecraft parody of that biome. This is my biome. Um, yeah, definitely more memorable. I listened to the Minecraft payphone once again. I, yeah, the fu I forgot. The, uh, there was a song with a, it did have Wiz Khalifa on it. Yeah. From photograph, hell yeah. Like I said, Nickelback, awesome. And I really like this song, I, I will admit. This song's pretty good, not gonna lie. Pieces by Rascal Flatts. Pink So What? Uh, that's also pretty good. I like that song. It's 2008 as hell. So What? Uh, I'm still a rock star. Uh, Players Holiday. Rapping for Trey. Please Don't Stop. Please Don't Tell. Please Don't Tell Her. What? Don't Tell Her What? Pray Acoustic by Justin Bieber. The Prayer. Princess of China, Coldplay, Prodigal by One Republic, Radioactive by Imagine Dragons. Like I said, oh, never mind. I shan't. Recognizer, Tron, The Remedy, Jason Mraz, Remember by Josh Groban, Remember When I, Wait, Remember When I Rained, Remember when it rained. Revolution by Rascal Flats. Ribbon in the sky, boys to, boys to men. Rihanna, diamonds, beautiful like diamonds, drive right like a diamond. Yes. Rihanna. Rihanna has a lot of hits. Jeez. I don't realize it. Rock your body. Rolling in the deep. What do you know about? No, that's not it. Adele. That's a pretty good album, I would say. Um, yeah, Adele, pretty good, pretty good artist. A little, a little overrated, but a uh, pretty good artist. Just a tad bit, I guess. Just like the the consequences of being like as popular as Adele. Chris Brown. Chris Brown. Santa Claus is coming to town. Satellite. Save me by Nicki Minaj. <laughs> Fucking. Also, like I said, Nicki Minaj. I, I I would consider myself a Barb. So, yeah. Saving me by Nickelback. Say by John Mayer. I'm not really a big fan of John Mayer. Nothing personal. That's just all right. Say all I need. Say goodbye. Say goodbye again. Say goodbye to Hollywood. Say it with me. <laughs> Secrets by Justin Timberlake. Oh, Senorita. Sorry, I can't. I can't read. I've heard "Sexy Love" Neo. Uh, oh wait, was Neo? I don't. Whatever. Never mind. "Sexy Back." Like I said, I I, I fuck with that song. Not gonna lie. Shanking it for Daddy once again. Why? Fuck Robin Thicke. She Ain't You, Chris Brown. I don't listen to much Chris Brown. She Will Be Loved. The show, the shoe goes on. I don't remember that's supposed to say show or shoe. I don't know. 
but Lupe Fiasco, pretty good rapper. Sound of the Night, Under the Mistletoe, Justin Bieber, uh, Sing for the Moment, Sleeping to Dream, uh, and, and So Close, Enchanted to a classic, pretty good movie. I, I, aren't they making like a sequel to Enchanted or something? Uh, whatever, uh, but Enchanted, pretty good. It would air on Disney Channel a lot. So small, Carrie Underwood, Silver, Pink, Soldier, Eminem. <laughs> Somebody that I used to know. Yes. <laughs> he made one song. Got. Giotti made one song. Now he's just somebody that I used to know. That's a good. It's a classic. Come on. Also a classic. I have great nostalgia for this song. I remember hearing this song very little. And yeah. Song I had nostalgia for. I, f I always thought on uh, my old YouTube channel I made a video uh, with this song. Uh, I always thought, hey, this should be a great... I don't know. I, I don't know. It's just something. I always thought Somewhere Over the Rainbow would be a great um, ending for Steel Ball Run for some reason. I don't know. It would be great. But, you know, what, what a Wonderful World, which is also part of it because it's a medley. Um, if that is not... If that does not show up in the Stone Ocean, if that does not show up in Stone Ocean anime at all, I'm going to be very pissed, because that's the name of the final chapter of the series, uh, uh, Stone Ocean. And I'm going to be very pissed if it is not referenced. Spacebound Eminem, Speeding Cars, Square Dance, Staircase, by John Williams, Stand Up by Javier Cullen, Stereo Hearts, if this is a song I think it is, I fucking love this song, my heart's a stereo, it beats for you so listen close, Dr. Dre still, Shop and Stare, One Republic, looks like the song is not here, um, the song I was talking about was Sing, from my by My Chemical Romance as a big My Chemical Romance song and as a big Danger Days song uh, fan. This is not about anything. It's just something off topic. I that's probably my least one of my least favorite My Chemical Romance song. I was just never a big fan of it. And I, this is coming from like the biggest Danger Days dick writer. I fucking love that album. I love the Killjoys as a concept and I love the whole universe. I'll definitely talk about you know why I love My Chemical Romance. Uh, def maybe. In another video, but it's definitely a long story I could go on and on about. But anyways, Hilary Duff, pretty good singer, I would say. Focus, focus, please. Strawberry Swing, Coldplay. Streetwalker, Michael Jackson. Stronger, also a classic. Oh, dude, I fucking love this song. This song, it feels like. Flipnote, old Flipnote AMVs, this song is cl a classic, it feels like old Flipnote AMVs, a lot of nostalgia basically, um, reminds me of like going to old basketball games or something like that, and um, I guess going to like old sports games, basketball, football, and uh, anime AMVs, did I already say anime AMVs, but definitely a, a, a really powerful song <laughs> due to how, uh, you know, Nostalgic it is, I guess. And it's also awesome. Stronger by Kelly Clarkson. I think that's what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Stuck on stupid. Stutter, Maroon 5. Summer Breeze, Jason Mraz. Summertime by DJ Jazzy. That, I don't know, I feel like that... I'm gonna go on a whim and say that's that one song from the regular show. Who knows? Summertime by Kenny Chesney. Superhuman by Chris Brown. Take Me There, Rascal Flats. Talking to the Moon? Talking to the Moon? Oh, let's see if it. Uh, yeah, it's Talking to the Moon. Acoustic. Tattoo, Jordan Sparks. Tattoos on this town. Jason Aldean. Taylor Swift, we are never, ever, ever getting back together. 
that was already on. I don't know. Thank You by Dito. Think Like a Man, Jennifer Hudson. Ooh, the classic Nightmare Before Christmas. Definitely one of my favorite movies of all time. That's a pretty good song. That song, yeah. This Is Mine Now by Jordan Sparks. This Love, like I said, songs about Jane. Classic. Till I Collapse, Eminem. Time After Time, Cindy Lauper. Also a great uh, singer. Time After Time, I think that's the one, yeah. Cindy Lauper, pretty good pop star. Definitely one of the greatest of the 80s. David Cook, Time of My Life. At the time of my Some very boomer songs now. Time of the Season by Blake Lewis. Probably a Christmas song. Tiptoe by Imagine Dragons. Toxic. Ooh. Ooh. Classic. You know, of course, me. Like I said, me being LGBT. Of course, I fucking love this song. Uh, we're literally all the same. Fucking hive mind. Literally fucking F slur hive mind. And I could say that. Because like I said. I'm gay. Bye. Anyways. I didn't even say the word. <laughs> Track one by Coldplay. I don't know if that's uh, artistic or not, but I guess they just did not mark them. These are just going to be a name stuff. I don't know. <laughs> so we don't know what it is. Oh, man. I fucking love this song. <laughs> I fucking love the... Oh, oh, man. Oh, man. What a good song. Sorry, I, I like Train. This is definitely a classic. Ooh. Turning Tables. Uh, I think that's Adele originally, but it's Glee. Twisted, Carrie Underwood. Umbrella, 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 eh. Undertog by Imagine Dragons. Violent Hill by Coldplay. Viva La Vida, classic. The... Uh, Definitely a classic, Fallen, you know, Fallen Kingdom. It might, it might feel a little weird, to, like, listening to Viva La Vida, the original one, uh, the Minecraft parody. Is, uh, that, that, that video is fucking crazy. I can't believe it. Anyways, yeah, it might feel a little weird to listen to that. Viva La Vida again. Wake Up Call, Maroon 5. Wall to Wall by Chris Brown. War, Boys to Men. Washington and Wonder, Stroke 9. Wasted, Water Runs Dry, Wave and Flag, that's uh, I believe that's the uh, one of the themes um, for the FIFA World Cup. The FIFA World Cup has not really, uh, obviously this might be a very um, isolated take because I'm American and you know, us Americans do not care about football, but man, I'll tell you, the fucking like f initial, well, I feel like the, the FIFA World Cups, I do like... I have a, like a a little bit of interest in soccer in general. I like it. It's a good sport. It's no wonder the rest of the world likes it. Um, but yeah, like I said, the FIFA World Cups have not hit the same since 2014. And uh, this is definitely a great song. And it makes me uh, really like the world. And I, I, love, I love the world. We are young, like I said. Fun, F-U-N. Great band. We Belong Together, Mariah Carey. Mariah Carey, pretty good artist. Uh, I don't think I've listened to this song, but I do like her songs. What Comes Around by Justin Bieber. I mean, <laughs> Justin Timberlake. What the, what the hell? Oh, this is a classic. Remember this song of uh, the uh, the video of Kamida, uh dancing to this song? Classic. Classic. What's my name? Rihanna. Oh, uh, it's obviously Rihanna. Real of the world. When love takes effect, I think. When love takes over by David Guetta. Was never a big Guetta. Um, I think they were like a DJ. They are the DJ. When your mind's made up by the Want soundtrack. Where is I hate this song? I don't get it. It's too sappy. It's too cheesy. And I do like cheesy music, but this is just too much. I it was never a big song. Never, never a big fan of the song. White America by Eminem. Why Georgia by John Mayer. Winner at losing. Winner at a losing game. Yeah, game. 
I, I'm so smart, I can assume. With you, Chris Brown. Without me, by the Eminem. Won't back down, Eminem. Won't go home. Won't stop. Wonderland by Collapsus. Words I couldn't say. Working man. Written in the stars. I don't know what that is. Yesterday, boys to men. Yesterday, Tony, Luca, Adam, something. Those are probably just Be Beatles covers, I would assume, of the uh, Beatles song, I would assume. You and me, parachute. Don't know. You found me, you found me, tired of it. I assume that's it. That's a good song. Blake Lewis. You raise me up. You raise me up, I think. Good song. Fifth Dimension. 8 Mile by Eminem, Hail Mix 2003, 16 Candles, 25 to Life, and finally, the last song, 93 Till, Souls of Mischief. So that was this person's, um, song library, I guess. What else we got here? I think, I think this is the one, sorry. <laughs> Oh fuck! Um, I f thought you were able to play like movies, or like you could download movies and like watch them on here. I'm not sure if you can do that here. I would assume they don't have any movies because that was like pretty good. But I always like this because you could like do this and you could like put like text files here and you can like. I always thought like having an iPod would be like the coolest shit because you can do like so much stuff. Look, you can play the games. I remember my, um. Yeah, just like, hold on. Wait, no. Um, it's a little hard to play with one hand, but we'll try. Uh, Breakout. I remember the the games that my dad had an iPad or an iPod or my family had one. It was definitely a later model. It was definitely more advanced, but I always thought it was the coolest stuff. I think they only had one song on it, and it was I Had a Feeling by Black Eyed Peas. Um, but other than that, I hope you enjoyed that video. Um, I'm kind of done. I don't know what I'll, uh, you know. That's That was cool. Very nice. Very nice intruding look into someone's life. I don't know why the what's up with the battery here. Because it had, you know, I had it hooked up. I had to hook up the, like, the chubby thing. The chubby motherfucker. Um, I'm surprised we still have one of these laying around to play this. And it still hasn't charged. It might have just been the age, like. But still, anyways, see you later. Hope you enjoyed this video.